These are the main achievements we have to get while we're out here. Defeat an Elder Guardian and eat an Enchanted Apple. I want to try to do this one today. Welcome back everyone to our Let's Play. We're out here on a survival island. I moved. No, not really. But I want to check if I was in a survival island situation, if I would get a sapling. Aha! I would be safe. I'm pretty sure there's a like a 90% chance you'll always get a sapling. I just think survival islands are so cool is because you have to build your whole empire here from one tree. But I'm out here in the ocean because I saw a boat right here. I guess we're going to give this a shot. Here we go. Oh god. Janners. I just want the loot. Uh. Okay, garbage. Hurry. Oh, bamboo. Oh, oh god, I'm dying. Oh god. Help me, dolphins. Oh, there's one. Oh, treasure map. I don't know why I'm so surprised. <laughs> All right, where would this take me? To the shore, I'm guessing. Oh, to our little island we were just at. <laughs> so is that how these work? Like, if I wouldn't have ever got that treasure map, do you think that treasure would have still been down here? Or do you think as soon as you generate that map, it just spawns it? No, because that's impossible for Minecraft. Something can't just be put into place wherever something's already generated. I know this is bragging, but I'm still so shook that this was put in the game because of my idea I put on the forums. That's just one of the coolest things. <laughs> okay, am I not on it? What? Oh, is it more back this way? Come on. Is it really gonna be in the stone? I don't wanna, uh, uh, oh my God. Oh, it was worth it though. That's for sure. Uh, what was that? Hello there. <laughs> Finders keepers. What the heck? It's like they were spying on me, waiting for me to find it. Now they're going to kill me and take it. Oh, God. No way. Good night, guys. <laughs> I guess they just don't really... Let me just get in this chest here. Don't mind me. Have a good day. Have fun getting off this island. And the reason I think we can get the Elder Guardian... Achievement is because there is actually you know what could I even do it? No, because I'll get that I need to get a lot of buckets of milk and then just go down and kind of break into the side I think we could do it. I think I just need to upgrade my armor a bit more and then just kill one and run <laughs> Got another boat, but look over there mushroom island even though we just found one near our main house So I guess it's not that surprising now hmm. What the heck where's the loop? Nah. Yeah, there's no loot in here. Come on. What is this? <laughs> what do you want? Oh, I'm holding carrots. Ah, home sweet home. Kind of. I'm still a little homesick. I miss my green mansion. I know. Hey, guys. I miss these guys, though. Are you kidding me? Do these guys really follow me? All the way, you just came over here to die. And leave your cubs to die. This is your choice. Oh my god, you guys are strong. Hey, free fish. Sorry about that. You wanna come inside? Come on in, little fatty. Yay, now we have a pet polar bear. We should probably name him, actually. Little Figgle. Ha <laughs> Little Fuggle. It's my only name tag, so you should feel worthy. Get! Get down! Yeah, so you better not despawn. Whatever. Better not despawn now. One thing they should change in Minecraft is this. Since these are rare, I've never actually used one in my Let's Play, I don't think, but since they are rare, they should always give you at least one level of XP. And I think there should probably be rarer ones that would give you probably five levels, but look. Level 19. Wow! I could get that from killing a cat. <laughs> well, guys, it's a brand new mo <laughs> Yeah, I just tweeted that <laughs> rant saying how XP bottles. I have some devs following me, so maybe they might see it and uh, change it. But you should not get the... Ha! Hello. Same XP for killing a pig, you know what I mean? Um, but anyway, like I said, new morning. Kind of have some new plans. Kind of. I'm kind of in a creativity blockage right now because... Since we're not staying here indefinitely, 
That kind of puts a damper on my building ideas because I won't want to work really hard on something knowing that I won't be here forever. Need a tall corner in the house. I guess I can shorten the shelf a bit. I want to grow some bam- How lucky was that that we got bamboo? Yeah, nice. This will be the sword that will pierce the guardian's heart. Our first diamond item. Nice. Should we enchant it? Wait, I don't have an enchantment table. <laughs> Never mind. I see my best friend outside. I want to see if he brought me this time. Bob! Bob. Bob. What'd you give me? Huh? Oh. Oh. Eh. <laughs> Maybe next time. I have an idea. Holy crap, little figgle. You're no longer little. But I can't change your name, so... Yeah, you're stuck. <laughs> I want to go find... All, through all the... Oh my gosh. Through all the villages we found... I want to go find a cartographer and trade with him and see if we can get a woodland mansion. How did you hit... Oh my god. I hate skeletons. I'm only going to take a few dogs. Oh, you're really hurt. You're really hurt. You're fine. You're fine. Fine. Let's go, guys. I got, like, a few comments last episode saying, You are so cruel for letting dogs die. How dare you? It's like, oh, my God. This is a game. And I said I'm not going to care because I want to have a giant, giant wolf pack. And you are a good boy. Let's go. Wait. I heard another zombie. I don't have all my dogs with me this time, so it could just be a random... It might... Yeah, it might be. I might be getting my hopes up for nothing. No, I hear a couple. I just want to check because there's a chance the enchanted golden apples spawn in dungeons. Gotta check. Oh, God. Ah. Well, I think it might just been a cave. No, it is... Oh, yes. Thank God. But, will it have my golden apple? Imagine how awesome that would be. Or just no chest at all. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> Please. Please. I don't even think I've found a golden apple. Enchanted, that is, in one of these in a long time. No. No. Oh, I knew it. I don't think I've been to this one. Interesting. Hopefully there's a cartographer here. That is who I am looking for. Ooh. Yeah, I have been here. Hello. Toshman. Farmer. No way. I was about to give up hope. We're at that village where we had the raid. And a cartographer. Yes. I just hope he unlocks the Woodland Mansion map. Well, here we go, I guess. Oh, wait. I forgot it's the bar. Oh, I'm always so used to just trading once and then gotta wait. All right, you stubborn, big-headed douche. Uh, oh, it's discount. Wait, what? It's eight. You raised the price on me? <laughs> I, I'll tell you what. If, if there's no Woodland Mansion map, there's going to be some trouble, all right? I will cut you down. Oh, my gosh. It's barely going up. I hate this trading system. Okay. Um, oh, God, this hurts. Oh, wait, I only have eight. I can't do that. Ugh. Let me go get more paper. The amount of stuff I'm doing for this guy. Man, I miss the old ways of trading. I know they just tried to make it more... Jesus, get him, guys. <laughs> I know they just tried to make it more unique and harder to do, but they made it a little bit too hard. Like, for this, for instance, when you're wanting the Woodland Mansion map, you have to spend... Like, two stacks of emeralds plus tons of your supplies just for a chance of getting a Woodland Mansion map. It might just be the Ocean Explorer map. Can I get the kitty that looks like Jerry? My real-life cat? Give it here. Wait. Oh, I gotta smell that first. Hang on. Oh, I don't have any coal! Don't just do that. Okay. Alright, will this be enough, buddy? You want pains? I got you your pains. Where are you going? Get back here! Where the heck is he going? Take my pains. <gasps> no. No. Oh, wait. No. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to feed you to the wolves. 
<laughs> I can't remember if there's a trade after that, but even if there is, I'm not going to spend that much time to try to get it. Hello, I'm back. What was your trade, by the way? Oh, leather worker. Okay. Hello. <laughs> get him. <laughs> Sorry. I just wanted to see it happen. Ow. 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 No! Get him! Ooh, I'll take that. Oh, potion. Ah, brand new morning, brand new day. Should we find out what this suspicious two is? Oh god, am I gonna die? Whoa. What the heck? What is that? Wait, why is it already gone? Wait, was that night vision? Why did it only last five seconds? What the? I didn't know you could make a night potion that lasts five seconds. Come get some. I've been training. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, God. Face it, Figgle. You're here forever. No escaping. So, what should we work on next? As you can see, this house is pretty much complete, but... Well, we can't really go up, so why not go down? So I'm going to make a cellar. I'm probably not going to finish it this episode. I just want to start it. I don't even know what I'm going to put down here. I was thinking, since I have all this knowledge from my old house, you know, building a, a laboratory, for example, my huge underground base, my house itself, I come here in a vacation with this knowledge, so why not put them ideas into this house? So we got a basic log cabin up here, but what if we go down here... And it just turns into a small, futuristic base. Maybe like the size of one of my labs at in the laboratory. And this is where I can just do some studying or something. I think that would be kind of cool. This is a peaceful spot, isn't it? There's an inviting cave right there. And I want to go in. Who's that? It's a mushroom. <laughs> Hello, you scared me. I'm already at the torches. I can't. Is that coal? Is that coal? I, I think it is. Usually when I watch my videos back, it's so clear and obvious what it was. What was that? I thought I heard something. But when I'm playing right now, this just looks... I can't see crap. I could be mining stone for all I know. But I'm getting XP. What? Is that a wall? Another inviting cave. Uh, parkour. Yo, I thought this ravine ended right there and it was just a real short one, but look at this. Oh my gosh. It's not even rendered all the way down. What is that? I think that's diorite. That was diamonds. Should we jump in? Why does this look like it's... It's like messed up. Uh-oh. It's going nighttime. I didn't bring a bed. Another inviting cave, though. Okay. Oh my. Okay, this might be worth it. I have a question for you guys. If you could pick one thing, just one thing to add to a cave system, what would it be? Like if they could only choose one thing to upgrade this place, what would you pick? I think I would pick, okay, so we got mob spawners, but I would want some dungeons, kind of like, what game am I thinking of? I don't know, it's like a level based system. So you enter a dungeon, oh, I guess like kind of like Skyrim, for an example. Um, you enter just kind of like a tomb of some sort and then you go through levels of waves of different mobs And then at the very end is the treasure in the final boss I think they should add something like that to minecraft because it's randomly generated world and it would just oh, it would be so cool I know they're probably gonna have something like that in Hytale, but that would be my pick. What would you choose? Whoa, look at this. Does this just enter right out into the room? Whoa Holy moly, get that out of here. What ravine is this? There's so many ravines in this world. Oh, this isn't the one with the mine shaft. So I didn't bring my comment question of the day book with me, but I'm going to have to be coming to an end here because I got school in, I think, half an hour now. Oh, crap, I'm not even ready. Oh, God. <laughs> um, but I can read it here. I'll put it in the book when I get home. It comes from Dawson Durr. Dawson Durr. What is the weirdest dream you've ever had? What the? Where am I? It's so dark. I, okay, I remember a lot of my dreams. I don't know what you call that. I think there was something. There's actually an app. 
<laughs> okay, I'm going off topic. There's actually an app you can get where as soon as you wake up, you write down your dream. Because most of, like, 90% of the time, you don't ever remember your dream. Unless you think about it a lot as soon as you wake up, that's how you remember most dreams. And just the weirdest one that I remember very well, and I and this is 100% true. This isn't just, like, out of my butt, just trying to think of something funny. I was in a cardboard town, pretty small, and everyone was a pea. I was a pea as well. You know, green pea. And I think I was just rolling around, like, rolling down the street. And then out of nowhere, a monster comes. Well, not even a monster. I think it was just like a giant human. And it just starts eating everyone. <laughs> and I just start rolling away. And then I wake up. Yep. <laughs> I'm sure I've had weirder ones. Like like me in my backyard with my brother. And we were defending from the Germans attack invading the U.S. <laughs> and I had like an MG set up on my back porch. And I was just firing. <laughs> That's not as unique though. Uh, I have so weird dreams. It's... Crazy. I don't know where the P1 came from, but it happened, and it's part of my life now. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end it here. So if this was a little bit of a shorter episode, I, I can't really tell. Um, I think I'll have another video tomorrow, though. Yeah, I think I will. Hopefully. Hopefully. If not, the next day. As soon as I'm about to end it, I find diamonds. Oh my god, yes. Finally. Give me these. What a great way to end the episode. Awesome. How many did we get? Three diamonds. All right, and there's probably a lot more. Oh, God, don't get too close. <laughs> okay, now I'll say bye. See you guys later. I mean, bye. Same thing. Oh, God. Huh. Actually, it's not the same thing. See you later is like, I'll see you later. Bye is like, I'm never wanting to see you again. Bye. I mean, see you later. <laughs>